Salsa bikes have personality. We have a strong color philosophy. Our colors and our finishes are really intended to show up, spark interest. I think it's easy to make a black bike or something you know is going to be safe. And I think that's kind of something Salsa's always done was kind of go outside that. It's definitely much more than, oh, this color looks good. There's a ton of work that goes into our process. We take the time to like research the space. We take time to look at color trends. We develop a ton of concepts and then we refine and refine and refine. At that point, we come up with like a handful of awesome ideas and awesome colorways that we we just love. And then we just kind of have to whittle it down from there. Our visual details really play a role in the brand experience, making sure you have a bike you can throw a leg over and fall in love with. We absolutely imagine or try and visualize what that bike looks like rolling up to the starting line at the gravel race, or if it's a fat bike, how that bike pops against the snow. My inspiration comes from everywhere. I grew up in the 80s. So I'm a huge fan of bold graphic patterns. A 70s van, 1980s rally cars, BMX pants, glittery gold painting, bowling ball, or Van Halen vintage album motorcycles, covers. a vintage album cover. Not Van Hagar. David Lee Roth style pants. 